You know, when it comes to weight, everyone has a different relationship with it. And some folks who do struggle trying to find that right path may be even more difficult. And someone who has grown up being in the public eye and is willing to talk about some of these stigmas that may be created a while around weight issues that really don't need to exist is Haley Hasselhoff, who joins me now. Haley, good morning. It's good to see you. How you doing? I'm great. How are you? I'm so excited to be on and to have this conversation with you. I love the way I love how you said conversation because I could not agree more because, you know, you hear weight issues and I feel like for everybody, we all go to different stigmas in our mind. And that's something that that unfortunately you've seen, but you're taking and you're trying to address it now in a positive way. Right. We all have different journeys that we're on, but one of the biggest journey that I think that we all need to be on is to love our bodies shamelessly, no matter what shape or size, and to really identify that our body does not define us. We define who we are. And so growing up in the public eye, let's talk about some of those stigmas. What have you personally dealt with that you've been able to overcome and why you want to spread your message today? I mean, I've had a lot of different challenges. I started out as a plus size model at 14. I'm still a curve model today. You like how I said plus size and curve because it's developed throughout my years. But I've dealt with bullying and I've dealt with a lot of challenges of people telling me that I couldn't be happy because of my size. And so I've really had to find ways to combat my good body days and my bad body days and to understand that I can love who I am today shamelessly and also love myself while trying to achieve new wellness or health goals. Well, since you brought up those wellness, wellness and health goals today, let's go ahead, share some, if you don't mind, what are some of the things that you've been able to hold on to, to maintain the healthy lifestyle that you just addressed? I think one of the biggest things is we've all just come out of a pandemic and I think we need to throw away self-judgment and put in self-acceptance. You know, I have really found great tools to be able to walk alongside myself during challenging moments with my mental health that's connected to my body image. And so I'm looking at ways in which I can nourish my body in positive ways as well. So I started taking Plenity, which is made from naturally derived ingredients. It's an FDA cleared prescription product that helps me feel more satisfied with smaller portions by feeling fuller. And with that, what it's allowed me to do is to be present during my meals, to understand that I have that control over how I'm nourishing my body, not just my mind. I like that nourishing your body, just even changing into that mindset, I feel like can be, you know, a key for some. And I feel like I know the answer to this next question, but I'm going to ask it anyways. When you do see people okay. in the public eye, I feel like we're seeing more and more women, especially being open, talking about their public image and talking about any weight struggles. It's got to be a positive that we're hearing this message about love yourself more than anything over some of the other things that maybe we've seen in the past. There's so much strength in vulnerability and there's so much strength in being able to tell your story because it relates to somebody else to know that their story is just as much validated and that we are beautiful and worthy at any shape or size. But it's okay also to try and find new tools that speak to you in a positive way to help encourage you to be the healthiest and best version of yourself. I love that folks like yourself are, are taking a stand when there's so much, you know, social networking out there and bullying happening and things that you are addressing this. Where can we go for more information, maybe even stay up to date with what you're doing and how you're continuing to spread this positivity? Well, Plenity is a prescription product. To learn more, you can go to my Plenity or you can follow my journey at H. Hasselhoff. You know what, Haley, thank you for, for joining us today and having this discussion. I feel like we're blessed to have a platform like this and to be able to share these important things is just so essential. So really a big thank you to you.